Already facing a shortage of officers, the pandemic exacerbated the problem as more officers left the profession or retired. Yeah, agencies like Charlotte Mecklenburg Police have to compete with surrounding agencies offering perks to entice officers to their department. Mary Calkins is live in Gastonia and Mary, that's what we're seeing there with the new program, right? That is exactly right, Alex. And this morning, Gastonia Police Chief is going to lay out an offer he hopes offer officers in cities like Charlotte just won't be able to turn down. Now, Chief Trent Conrad is up. He's preparing to lay out a $15,000 incentive for what's called North Carolina Certified Lateral Transfers. Gastonia City Council authorized the money during their meeting last night. Lateral transfers are essentially someone already working as a police officer in a different agency. Chief Conrad said he believes the incentive, currently the highest in all of North Carolina, will help attract qualified sworn officers to fill Gastonia's ranks. Now, earlier this year, the department was offering signing bonuses of up to $7,500 and other perks like take home cars, extra pay for working different shifts and speaking a foreign language. Now, last week, we told you CMPD was short about 300 officers just a year ago, but has changed their recruitment process and is seeing a boost in hiring. Now they're going to have to compete with a big incentive from Gastonia. Now, in just a few hours, I'm going to be here speaking with Gastonia's police chief about this $15,000 incentive. We're also going to be talking about how many officers he's hoping to hire. You will want to stay tuned for that report at noon. But for now, reporting live in Gastonia, Mary Calkins, WBTV, on your side.